A lot of it's staying very close to the coastline, but it's dense enough that it's causing us some pretty low visibility in some spots closer to the coast and even a couple miles inland where we're down to about a quarter mile the less uh, or less in some spots. So the tips for today leave early or probably this week while we still have this pretty deep marine layer pattern that's going to be happening. Allow for a lot of extra space with the car in front of you. Drive slowly. Use the low beams. Uh, just some good days to uh, leave early and just plan ahead. You can see that dense fog advisory is in place He's for the good. entire coastline. Make it's going sure to be through about 9 a.m. this morning. And then in December, the valleys, especially below. areas of Ventura County valleys where we do have a deeper marine layer most of the time and also moves a little further inland for some of those spots. Then the only place left with the excessive heat warning and some dangerous heat, that's going to be the low desert through tonight. We have that excessive heat warning that's still going to be there because we're still getting close to about 112 degrees. So very hot temperatures down for the low desert. We do still have the risk of heat related illnesses uh, if you are down that way. We have nicer temperatures, fall like weather, even below average in the forecast. Not quite yet, but I'll show you in the seven day in just a moment and why. Palm Springs at 79 degrees. So you really see the difference through the microclimates this morning. And then as you get quiet, so we have this little trough that is digging down just to the north of us. But for the most part, we're not going to see too many changes in the atmosphere this week. And that's why most of our temperatures are just going to stay warm as we take you all the way into the weekend. And then by the weekend, we start to see this low uh, mid 90s the next few days by this weekend, upper 80s. And that will take us into next week as well. So that's going to be a nice little break from the heat. tomorrow, lower 90s by the weekend. And then we will finally have even some 80s there next week for the Antelope Valley. So we still have to get through the work and school week this week, but it's really nice to see some of those